Okay, so today is another day. Um, honestly, I spent most of today inside. It was an astonishing 30 degrees Celsius. I'm kind of out of breath right now because I just climbed up this hill. Literally everything is a hill here. The second day I went for a walk after my first really big walk, my calves were burning. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go watch the sunset today. I did my last test I need to take to become certified. I had to do one mini one and I absolutely annihilated it. It was pretty awesome. And this morning I have literally been tackling my travel plans because I wanted to do a tour with Kentucky, but then it literally just got like completely, it just didn't work out. Here's a tip, book in advance. If you can't, then you have what happened to me. That's pretty much what today's been, tackling travel stuff, finishing the licensing stuff working. So I was gonna go swimming, but the test took a little bit too long. And I always forget when you don't have your own vehicle, it takes a lot longer to get places. And so when I take public transportation, it takes me a lot longer than it would if I drove. So we're on our way, even though the sun's right here, it's gonna soon be setting. Going to Kangaroo Point, something like that. That should be good. Tomorrow, I'm gonna go to the Brisbane. It's not a zoo, but it's like a koala place. Australian zoo, which is supposedly amazing, but there's also this lagoon that's a little bit cheaper and just as amazing, so. That's what we're gonna check out. We bring you along this little sunset day. I literally have that song in my head right now that's like, more energy, more energy, more footwork, more footwork. Because I literally went to the grocery store to pick up some grocery store sushi because I absolutely love that stuff. And it's super reasonable in terms of price. And I didn't realize that the last bus was like 4.30. It's past 4.30 now. So now I'm like jaunting over to another bus to another the bus stop that leaves in 13 minutes and the walk says it's 18 minutes away. So I'm like, let's go. I think regardless I'll make it for the I'll make it for the sunset, but it's gonna be Oh, I forgot the go card. Got the go card. We're going up the same stupid hill. Round two. The sun is supposed to set at 5.45, the bus is supposed to take 30 minutes. I should be at a perfect spot. Really don't even know what to say, but hey, I got the sushi, gaiaizos, and some, a roll, and it better be the best sushi ever because I literally missed a bus for it. This is where the sun's at. See, she's so pretty, but she's still high in the sky. Here's another funny part to the story. I all of a sudden have to pee now. I just had this crazy thought. I just had this crazy thought sitting here. What if I had to cook these? I don't think I have to, but what if? That would just be cherry on the top. I just decided after all my hard work, I'm gonna have one of these because they're just looking at me. And already I can tell they probably should be heated up for best effect, but here we go. Do they slap? Half slap, not a full flap. Slap, not a full slap. Maybe with some soy sauce it'll taste a little better. What else I just realized? I didn't grab chopsticks, so now I'm gonna be eating sushi in public with no chopsticks, with my concrete finger grippers. You know what, it doesn't matter. The sun is already setting, <laughs> you can see it in the video. The sun is starting to set. It's starting to do its thing. <laughs> How many minutes past the bus arrival time do you think it's not gonna come? Three minutes since it's supposed to be here. Three minutes is a lot of minutes. Five minutes past. quickly starting to get dark and I just saw like the most beautiful pink and now it's not pink anymore I can feel it we're getting close it's right up there 
I mean, we missed 99% of it, but here's the tail end. So beautiful. There's actually such a night life here, you know, night kayaking. And then behind me on these cliffs, there's literally people rock climbing. Who would have thunk it? Overall review, definitely worth it, but come earlier. So I decided that I'm taking an Uber back because it's $13 and that's like almost $10 and it's just less stress, less walking and it's pitch black. So, you know, a smidge safer. Um, but I'm doing a carpool, so it's $13 instead of like $20, which is amazing. So, girl math, we're winning. <laughs>